Hi, we're Joel and Leah. And today's video is five things Americans do that drive Brits crazy. Crazy. <laughs> crazy town. Crazy. 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 You have sent us a crazy town. <laughs> Okay, just so you know guys, before we get going, we have made this exact same video in reverse, so mm -hmm. things that Brits do that drive Americans crazy. Yeah. Um, just so you can't get too offended. Yeah. Lots of you will probably be triggered by this video and triggered. be like, oh my gosh, I'm so offended. But we have just <laughs> done this for Brits as well and on how annoying Brits are, so. <laughs> triggered. Triggered, I'm triggered, <laughs> no. Get over it. Yeah, we make fun of everyone, regardless of who it is, even ourselves. Take it with a pinch of salt. It's a pinch of salt. Please. Honestly, because don't take it personally. Mm -hmm. don't it, take none of it is personal. Personally. It's all a joke. Yeah. British people are sarcastic. I don't want to see any hateful comments, okay? None. If you're going to leave a comment, just leave an emoji. Yeah. Just leave an emoji. Just leave a dagger emoji. <laughs> yeah. If you want to say something horrible, <laughs> that will do. So obviously, the UK and the USA are very close. There are lots of similarities between the countries. Yeah. But there are also a lot of differences and we both piss each other off. <laughs> <laughs> so shall we kick it off with the first thing that they yeah. that they do? Yeah. Okay, the first thing they do is say, Oh my god, say water. Say water. <laughs> say it again. Say water. <laughs> say table. It's wait. so cute. Oh, wait, table sounds the table. same. Table. Table. Say table. table. Oh wait, no, it's not as good as water. Water, water, water. Yeah, yeah, just saying that I love your accent. You like it's a compliment, I guess. But it's just when you hear it all the time. Yeah. And it's, it's the making fun, like oh, you say water, so funny. It's like no, we just pronounce all the letters. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it can be a bit annoying, just constantly like coming back to the accent. It's like yeah, we speak differently. Carry on talking. Yeah, which I'm, I know is kind of ironic because we've made videos like, oh, Americans say this, but let's ignore that. We know we're hypocrites. Yeah. <laughs> let's move on. Also, on the note of accents, like what's even more irritating and annoying and uncomfortable is when Americans try and change like how they speak a little bit to sound like us, but they're still, and, we, and it, because it's so jarring, like it's really hard not to cringe. They'll be like, <laughs> oh, I was just like laughing at you, and they're like oh it's so painful i can't deal i don't know maybe it's a slip of the tongue but it's too much it's just, uh, it doesn't bother me but i it find it you. hilarious <laughs> okay this next one's to do with the service industry in america mm -hmm. um it's when they take your plates away too soon so say if you yeah. and i were eating and you finish first because yeah. you eat fast and so do i Tick. but you fin you've finished even faster than i have correct and they've taken your plate, but I'm still eating. Yeah, hate that, hate that. I've said it before, I'll say it again. <sighs> Don't do that to me. Don't clear Brit's plates until everyone Everyone's has finished. finished eating. It's so, so rude. rude, so rude. It's literally grinds on my gears. And we know why, we know that- You're the, efficient. Your views is that yeah, you don't want a dirty plate sat in front of you, you want it gone as quickly as possible, but that is so rude in no. the UK. Yeah, it's so rude. I hate it. Yeah. It makes me feel like I'm the only one eating. Yeah. And I'm just like, this sucks so much. Titties, titties, titties. Titties, titties, titties. Also, if everyone's got their plates still and people are coming to the end of it, you know, sometimes you're like, oh, can I try a bit of that? Yeah. And I'm like, I've still got my plate there. Yeah. <sighs> anyway. Yeah. So that drives us nuts. Yeah. <laughs> that drives us nuts. No, that drives us nuts. That's <laughs> another thing that drives us nuts. <laughs> 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 the next thing that drives us absolutely crazy bonkers is um the inability to use indoor voices <laughs> <laughs> we wrote this down before we filmed the video and i was like i'm sorry but they're just always loud yeah americans are we've spoken about it before physiologically the way that american accents work the sound reverberates more than british voices I, we won't bore you with the explanation just take it as correct yeah Americans are just louder in general than we are. Is this is no such thing as an indoor voice with them? No, every There's conversation no is sort of a few decibels higher. Imagine if one of us was American, we'd have to constantly adjust the levels of the sound. Oh, yeah. so one would be shouting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, just they're normal, and the other one would be. Absolutely, it wouldn't work. It's a bit offensive, uh, this but I just yeah, I can't deal. I can't deal with the. My dad's the other way around though. Like he, oh, he's so annoying. In America, we laugh at it. Because there's one restaurant we went to, Outback, if you know it, it's an Australian restaurant in, in, in America. America. Cool. Australian. Anyway, 
<laughs> oh, genres of food Australian. That you do. It's just burgers being like, it's Australian. Anyway, anyway, we went there and the waitress obviously is very loud and she has to be because she's talking to like over all of the restaurant. And my dad is very quiet and she goes, uh, anything for you, sir? Like drink wise. And my dad went, nothing for me, thank you, I'm fine. And she was like, what? And he's like, nothing for me, thank you, I'm fine. And she's like, huh? And we had to translate for him because. He speaks very quietly and he doesn't just give one answer just going, no thanks. He always has to go, nothing for me, thanks, I'm fine. We're like, Dad, why can't you just A, speak louder, or B, just say, no thanks? No, like, thanks. you're confusing her. That's like, just going, so funny. nothing for me, thank you, I'm fine. And That's it's just really so funny. funny. It was a complete clash of cultures <laughs> where he was just very quiet and saying a million words. <laughs> and she's just like, huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> The next one is their overzealous patriotism <laughs> in that very posh accent. Yes. It's just too much. Yeah. The kids, the schools, the national anthem. Standing the up lot. in your classroom, like with your hand on your heart, or a baseball. So this is funny. Yeah. My mum and dad went to a baseball game in America. Oh, the celebrations after they score. No, 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 um, no, no. That's, that's a whole other thing. But they, before the game, they all stand up, hand on heart, sing their national anthem. And I was like, oh, so what did you do? Just sat there and mum went, no, I stood up and joined in. And I was like, mum, you're not even American. And she is just imagining her standing there, Debbie Wood, this British woman, like, joining in with the song. Oh, it is so funny. She doesn't even know oh the words God, either. That's so, it's so good. What was she like? I don't know. I wasn't there. Oh, but then we went to a basketball uh, game all yeah. together. And um, I, me and my brother's girlfriend refused to join in. We just sat there like... We're like, this isn't our... Like, I'm happy to watch. Like, go for it. America's great. But we're just like, I'm not joining in. This isn't my country. Whereas the rest you of my family, yeah, all of their like, I don't know the words, but did I'm going to do, do it. it. Yeah. <laughs> I think Ben stood up. I don't think Ben did the heart thing. But then me and Caitlin were just like, we are not doing this. That's so funny. Because you're, you're an attention seeker. He wanted yeah. people to look at you and be like, why aren't yeah, they doing yeah. it? Plus, I'm also like, that's essentially pledging allegiance to America. And I'm sorry, but I'm English. Yeah, fair play. I'd probably join God him. save the Queen, yeah? God save the Queen. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah? Just end up with a yeah. Yeah. God save the Queen, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> never removed. <laughs> never <laughs> <laughs> This is my Queen, I will never remove it. <laughs> we, we've never sung our national anthem in class or at school. We don't even know the words. I don't even know the words. God, God save, save our gracious, our gracious queen. queen. God Quite. save our gracious queen. God, God save our gracious save queen. Our gracious queen. queen. God yeah. save. Our... We don't even know it. We don't know. And it. that's not because we're not proud to be British. It's just because we're kind of like. Then we've never. Britain's great, but so is other yeah. countries. Yeah, and we'd all rather not sing. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, please don't make us sing. Make us sing. Please. please don't make us all do the yeah, same thing oh all together. No. There's nothing worse, is there? Turn to the person next to you and say your name and, That's and make worst. friends with the person next to you. Oh, stop. stop I'd rather it. die. Yeah, literally. <laughs> literally, I'd rather die. Um, and the last one is. The last one is the fact that you always assume you're the only country that has freedom of speech. And I get it. We've, we've touched on it before. We've had some comments being like, yeah, but we're the only country that puts it in our constitution or whatever it is. And we haven't got a written constitution. And we haven't got that. And by saying that hate speech in the UK can get you in prison. But I'm like, that doesn't mean we haven't got freedom. Technically, I guess that does mean we don't have complete freedom, freedom to say anything. Speech. But we don't want people who say hateful things to be allowed to live. Like, yeah, I know. If anyone incites racism and hatred and things like that, they deserve to be locked up. And every British person is like, here, here, get them locked up. No yeah. one wants them. Yeah, definitely. So I don't understand. And that's why we don't have the sort of equivalent of the Ku Klux Klan in the UK. Yeah. Because we wouldn't stand for that. And they're instantly in jail. So instantly. I, instantly. So I don't understand why people are like, yeah, we're the most Freedom free country in the world. And I'm like, no, you're not. Like, every yeah. country is free and we just don't stand for bull beep. Yeah. I was going to say we'd rather be safe than be free, but we're neither, are we? Not safe. We're not we're safe not free. anymore. We're not free. <laughs> but yeah, well, this is I, thing. It's no, just, I do agree. Do you feel free? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I can say anything. Yeah. But the thing is, the thoughts that I have are not necessarily going to offend people. No. But I do feel like I can say Because you're a nice person, but anyone yeah. who does have those thoughts doesn't even deserve to live, so... Yeah, the freedom of speech thing, I completely yeah. agree. But anyway, get America, yeah, I guess you are free, like, congrats. 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 You're a very free country. 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 <laughs>
Yeah. No, I love the jaw for one. Yeah, so I'm saying something really, really important. Yeah. I know, so I'll just push my jaw <laughs> even further into your face. There's just something Brits do all the time when they're really pretentious. Yeah, yeah. so like, put you in front of Imagine if Hot Channel was just us talking like that. See, the thing is... Hi, I'm dude, John Lear. I'm Lear. Yeah. I'm really want to push my jaw. So annoying. Okay, it's so annoying. Can't even look at myself doing that. So there we have it. That's five things that uh, Americans do that piss off British people. Like we said, we did do another video of British things that we do that piss off Americans. So go and watch that as well. And if you have been triggered, then please <laughs> leave a comment below. We'd love to hear your comments. Yeah, we love triggered say. Americans. Just... <laughs> no, seriously, we get so much hate from Americans. And it's like, how many times do we have to say, this is all a bit of fun? This is all just a bit of fun. It's just a bit of fun. Just a bit of fun. Just lighten up, America. No, I'm lighten up. I know you've got Donald Trump as a president, but just lighten, lighten up. up. <laughs> Amazing! All right, guys, please um, leave us a comment like we said if you are triggered. Subscribe to our channel. Click on the bell if you want to get notifications yeah. so that you can get triggered every week. To get <laughs> Yay! <laughs> and if you want to buy us a coffee, 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 then you can. There's a coffee link in the description. Let's all have a coffee together. Let's have a coffee, but only if you haven't been triggered. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> All right, guys. See you All next right. time. See you. Bye. Bye. See ya, as they say in America. <laughs> this is five things Americans do that trigger Brits. <laughs> 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 oh, great.